What is going on guys? Today we're gonna be making shit float. Alright, so let's get into it. So for today's tutorial the idea is to get a fishing line and to hook up an object onto that fishing line and then hang the fishing line off the ceiling, take a few pictures and go into Lightroom, remove the fishing line and voila you have a floating object whichever it may be, a milk carton, um, your wallet or whatever, any object that you can hook up onto a fishing line is gonna be floating after this tutorial. Alright, so for this trick we're gonna need a fishing line and an object that we're gonna um, hang off of the wall using our fishing line. So right here we have our fishing line and here's my watch aka the object that I'm gonna hang using the fishing line and I'm gonna hang it over this lamp right here. Alright, so here's the final result. I have the fishing line hooked up to my watch and then right here onto the lamp. There it is. Okay, so we're gonna take a couple of pictures of the watch and then I'll see you guys in Lightroom. Alright, now that we've taken our pictures, we're gonna import them to Lightroom and this is where all the magic happens. We're gonna start off by taking um, well, by removing the fishing line from the image, as you can see, it is very noticeable. But before we do that, we're going to crop our picture because we can get rid of that excess fishing line on top. And this is going to reduce the amount of spot removal we're going to have to do in Lightroom. So we're going to use the spot removal tool and we're going to make it um, a bit thin. As you can see, it's already thin here. You can use your mouse scrolling wheel to kind of increase and decrease the size of the brush. And we're going to make it as thin as the fishing line and just slowly okay I didn't do that very, okay and we're just gonna slowly drag it on over the fishing line kind of drawing on top of it and Lightroom does a pretty good job for moving the tool now shooting with a wide aperture to blur the background is gonna help you a lot on this and kind of having your subject um, contrasting to your background is gonna help a lot so try to shoot with a wide aperture and have your that background blur and try to shoot your subject, make your foreground different than your background. So this is going to help Lightroom remove the fishing line as clean as possible. And as you can see, did a pretty great job. I'm not even going to um, use the spot removal tool. I could just crop this just a little bit more. And we kind of get rid of that thing on the top. And now we have our floating watch with no Photoshop, no magic, no nothing. So all we used is our object, which is the watch, and a fishing line. Now we can go ahead and edit our image accordingly. And I'm not going to bore you with the editing. Um, I'm just going to show you the final result. And I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Leave a like if you like this tutorial and subscribe for more content. And as always, guys, I'll see you in the next one.